Hello YouTube, it's Jack from the FIFA Gamers and today we're going to be showing you some methods on the web app, so over to you. Okay, yeah, MK FIFA here from FIFA Gamers as well and uh, we're going to be showing you a bronze pack method and um, the other one, what's it called? But this not me, that they still work and everything, even right now, so yeah, so uh, the bronze, let's get on with the bronze pack method and this is probably, probably that, uh, probably, probably. This is probably one of the best one methods to go for and everything because you know it's that uh, it's uh, pretty decent and i used to do it on my account and get like a lot of money every day like 8k to 10k a day which is pretty good uh yeah so basically the way you gotta do this is if you don't know already which i'm guessing most of you do know anyway but in case you don't you just gotta go and really just buy a normal 400 bronze pack i just said when i took my club by accident go and keep going mike <laughs> Some weird guy. Yes. Yeah. Alright, so you, you gotta buy um the four hundred coin bronze pack. Yeah? Got it sorted. Yep, sure have. And then basically all you do is put any players you get up for one fifty, two hundred, and all you gotta do is sell two of them to make a profit. And rare contracts nowadays go for about two hundred buyer, maybe even a one fifty bid. So if yeah. you get any of them it's pretty handy. I'd only do any consumables in any players, no kits, because if they're bronze, they're going to be shit. So I should put it that way. And there's a new bronze pack, which I didn't actually know about. Uh, I reckon you can get pretty sick kits from the bronze thing. Most of them are actually pretty good. Yeah, and also, don't have adverts on them. Oh, just when you're yeah, 18 there. But some um, players, they can go for a lot of money. Like, you can get some bronze players that yeah, are actually worth the pace. That's like what five them. grand. Yeah, usually it's the pace, but not all always. Their, but. All the rest of their stats are pretty shit, so it's normally <laughs> just the pace that makes them. Uh, so one if you got a shiny guy, yeah, no, but if you got a shiny guy, then check them out on the market before you just go randomly pin them up for one hundred and two hundred yeah, by now. I'll leave a um, website in the description so you can check your guys. It's basically a FIFA Ultimate Team database. So yeah, and or you could just search up on the uh, Xbox or whatever. But whatever, don't mind. I don't know, Mike. What do you reckon about helium? What do you think they go for? Helium, I reckon. Only I can plus ones. Sell them for you can probably sell them for around 450 by now, 500 by now, which See, I usually if do. If you get one of them, one of them pack don't even have to pay for itself. So I mean, they uh -huh. have to pay for itself, and that is a pretty decent badge. I am actually going to keep that for myself. And also, you get the squad fitness. Squad fitness they yeah, sell for a, about 1,500. Even the normal oh. fitnesses go for about 200. Yeah, they can go for 200 as well. But normally, what I do is I keep I send all the everything I get in the pack to the trade pile. Except for the player attributes, the ones that give you extra attributes yeah, to your players. Yeah, but the one like plus five head in there just shit. So yeah. Yeah, no, you, there's no point of having those. And you can get like uh, silver contracts in your pack as well, and they can go for like if you're up to four hundred, four hundred coins. I've had quite a lot of them, and you can get those two hundred coin cards as well on it, and yeah. four hundred coin cards. But like as we say, the the uh, yeah. The consu uh, the consumable piles have actually crashed. Like the consumable things are actually crashed. Yeah, the market's yeah, crashed. That's yeah. my point, pretty much. Like fitness cars, these bronze ones. Let me find one quickly. They didn't used to go for two hundred, but now they probably will. So, what was the other method? They would all they would always go for two hundred. It's just that it takes longer at yeah. two hundred. People would rather buy them one fifty. So now, nah, even um, a silver contracts go for like five hundred. So now. Nah, I think I'm doing this right, Mike. You go goal players, and you go like a popular formation like four four two, and Premier League is it, Mike? And you put what? You just uh, what? What are you talking about? The first half minute? Yeah. Thing? Yeah. You just like look for basically you put all your coins you're willing to spend on that player, and basically what on buy now or maximum price? On um bidding and yeah. buy now, either one don't matter. Just put you don't need to put. Yeah, just buy now, maximum price, something like that, and then you just go straight to the 59th minute where all the new deals are coming out, or most of the new deals are coming out, like people were putting up things, and then now with the crash in the market, people are putting things a lot cheaper than they are. Like the other day, I got this card for like 10 grand less than it's actually worth, and sold it off for a nice 12k profit, and that's a big profit. And I mean, you can do that as long as you know which players sell for a lot of money. Don't just do it if you don't know yeah, if they can sell. Do it in the market you know. So I know the Premier League. And also, if you're wondering, oh, it's taking him about a minute already to get to the 30th minute. That's because I'm lagging. So, yeah. And, um, yeah, that's it. Oh, there was an overturn there. I didn't actually see how much that was for. 1K for an overturn. He's got five-star skills in a 4-4-2. That is definitely worth it. I think he's got four-star, actually. I ain't sure. No overturn. There's three guys in the Premier League who have it. 
It's Overturn, oh. Ben Arthur and Nanny, I'm sure of it. So And even no. though he's right wing, he'll probably go for that. So I'm gonna put him up for a K star price. I don't think Obitan is. I think he's four star. No, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. Well, I don't know. I'm, I'm quite sure as well. So we'll see. Put him up for one point yeah, we'll seven. See. He's got decent stats, but he'll sell because he's probably five star skills. So that was it. And um, yeah, just do it on a market you know about. And the fifty and the bronze pack method. Let's see if anyone sold. I doubt it. But, so no. It, you, no it usually takes a long time for the bronze pack. Exactly. I mean, when on the last minute they're gonna probably start selling, except for the. Uh, fitness cards they might sell and the healing ones before that but also yeah. um i forgot what i was gonna say crap do you want to end it here or have you got something to say or not uh oh yeah you know on the 59th minute thing like be careful because players they they change their prices drop and sometimes go higher all the time if they come more in demand or become more in demand they're gonna go higher and if there's more of them or after a while they'll just go down anyway so mm. just be aware of that yeah and we'll leave it in the description this site is, I think it's like FUT dot I don't know but it's a database yeah, a and database. it gets updated yeah. quite regularly so but obviously if you see oh he's 4k uh, and he's going up for fr uh, 3k it's a worth it but not 3.5 because like for all you know it might not have been updated you might lose those 500 coins so I'd only say to you if it says about a 1k profit in it from the um, database, so say you're buying this, wait, I'll quickly check so you can see, but it's like F, look, you won't be able to see it because it's in this square, which... Just yeah. type in FUT database and then you yeah. get it on It'll the It'll be in the description, search. but let me just check, although the people can't see, Gabriel Obertan at the moment is saying, oh, he's only going for a K, but if we load the prices for what left, Per formation, four four two is going for weight less than a k. I might have actually made a loss here, but I'll add an annotation if I have made the loss. So thanks anyway. Thanks for watching. Bye. Mike, you want to do your own? Uh, anyway, FIFA gamers. Peace. Peace. <laughs>